Hi guys, this is Patrick for Screen Studio. Uh, today I won't talk about Screen Studio itself, but um, I have a friend who has an iPhone and uh, actually uh, couldn't figure out how come the iPhone was uh, uh, filled up and has uh, had no space left when looking at the space left on the, on the device. So uh, I gave it to me and uh, I finally found out the issue and this is quite a quite common issue with the iPhone. I'm gonna do this, the cleanup on my iPhone I have on my laptop currently connected with Ubuntu. So uh, you just uh, open uh, once connected and that you have accepted the uh, on the iPhone that the computer uh, can be connected to, to this iPhone. Then you go in the um, the uh, shared folder. In my case, it's my iPhone, so it's called Patrick's iPhone. And look for the download folder, this one. In Ubuntu, um, it's 14.04, so just connecting your iPhone and uh, clicking OK on your iPhone, that uh, accepting that connection, and those two mount points will show up. So you need to go into one uh, containing the, f the picture you, you take with your device. But what we want to look at is the download folder here. Downloads with an S. So you go in there and there's a bunch of subfolder in there. Like in mine, I currently have uh, over a thousand folders in there. That's quite amazing. Uh, I've calculated the uh, the space taken by those folders and the content and it does add up to 4.5 megabytes that's not that much in my case but with the iPhone of my friend it was adding up at two uh, at 4.2 gigabytes and we were wondering how come uh, there was like four gigs missing in his iPhone because we were looking at the app installed and um, we couldn't find where they were and he had reset everything, reinstalled everything uh, and it was always coming back so it came to my mind to have a look with Ubuntu in the iPhone itself and then all you need to do is select everything and press delete those should be deleted. So Ubuntu will say, can't put the folders to the trash. Uh, do you want to delete immediately? So I'm going to click delete all. And in my case, I will just get 4.5 megabytes back. But with the iPhone of my friend, it was way more than that. And actually, look, it's saying 22, 25 megabytes. I think it's going to take a while to uh, to finish that process because there was a bunch left. Okay, it has started to delete. So actually, I think I'm going to get back 22 megabytes. But uh, with the iPhone of my friend, um, it was up to 4.2 gigabytes. So if you have any missing space left um, on your iPhone, Meaning that you should have at least like six gigabytes free on your iPhone, and actually you don't have that space. There's a four gig missing somewhere. Just open uh, with Ubuntu, or I don't know if in Windows you can do the same thing or in the, in the Macs, but <clears throat> with Ubuntu you just connect your iPhone to it and uh, just delete whatever is in there. And job's done, and you'll get more. Uh, you'll get back that free space that seems to be forgotten by uh, iOS itself. So now I'm gonna have a look at my iPad also to see if I have the same issue because on my iPad, I think I've lost like one gig of space. So I'm I'm kind of uh, wondering, and well, I will find out after the the end of that video. So. People, uh, if you want uh, on your iPod, your iPhone, or your iPad, you will you want to claim back that lost space, then 
connect your uh, iDevice to Ubuntu 1404, just open the uh, file browser and just go in the download folder and delete the content of whatever is in there. And everything will work after that with more space available on your device. Hope you enjoyed. And uh, that was a tip that I just discovered and I had to talk about it. Thank you for watching. See you another time. Bye.